Now we will begin to get into the actual body of the uh, of the content when we write a page. First, I would like to talk about the importance of header tags. What is a header tag? Well, if we go ahead and look at one of my pages here, you can see that uh, the very first thing you see here is this uh, this text choosing the best card, and it's uh, it's bigger and it's in bold. Now, how did I do that? Well, I did that by using the header tag. If you can see here that the the keyword phrase that I am optimizing this page for is choosing the best card. So not only do I have it there, but I also want to have a header tag. So what does this look like in the code? Okay, right here you can see that choosing the best card is surrounded by h2 and then backslash h2 enclosed in, in the brackets. Basically this is how we create the header tag. It tells the search engine that this is, is probably the most important phrase on the page. Um, you can use H2, H3, H4. H2 is, is the one that I typically use for the big one, and then I might use H4 if I'm going to include additional headers down lower on the page. So again, you can see that H2 made this a lot bigger, and uh, that makes it stand out. So again, you can even see pages that sometimes have more than one header tag, and you can certainly do that. But I usually try to just have one H2 tag. So again, I, I, I strongly believe that every page that you create should have a header tag, and in that, especially in the first one, in the biggest one, should be the keyword phrase that you're optimizing your site for, uh, uh, that particular page. If you're trying to optimize a, a page for maybe two keyword phrases, you can have one here, and then maybe down, down a little bit further, you have another header tag, and you throw that phrase in there as well.